Good Wednesday morning. It's cloudy, cool, and pouring rain outside. So a good day for inside projects. And today I am relying on the propane stove in the trailer to heat my water, get my coffee going. Because when I get up this morning, I'll show you what I started to do. So with a really amazing steel brush and a scraper, that's Pearl's bed, I scraped down the top of the cook stove, gently, and painted it. All my grates are painted. I don't know why I'm using this, it's not hot. Doors are painted. Oop, missed a spot, gotta get that. Got up underneath everything was scraped down and wiped down. Notice I didn't do the bottom because it doesn't really need it, so I'm not going to waste the paint. Everything's a matte black, and it's high heat. You scrape it down, have two cloths, one damp, one dry. You wipe the rust and all the black crap off of it with the dry one. Scrape it again and go back over it with... Um, with a damp one, not soaking wet, not dripping, just damp. You can just feel it's damp. And that way you can, you can see when you leave it, it, you know, leaves a little mark at every now and again. Um, I had to stuff one up here because there's that stupid drip in the rain. And it was of course preventing it from drying. So this is where the drip was. This was, as you know, by the last video, this was all rusty. So now it's all clean. And I've got a little bit of cleaning to do, getting a little tiny bit of soot off. And uh, other than that, um, I'm not going to do the oven right now. I sprayed above the oven, but I haven't done the oven yet. That's that's another job for when my lungs stop gasping for air. I actually have the big door open. That's my wood box. And I have... The window open and I had the back door open but I had to close it because the wind was coming through and bringing the rain in so a couple of hours I'll give it Pearl's dishes and my cedar um, to get it, the fire started and you can see I made myself some knitting needles out of cedar <laughs> those are all the little whittling parts that I use for starting and thank heavens a couple of days ago I stocked up the, the box I used the whole pile of it up to here yesterday, and I discovered that just sticking one log in at a time works just as well as banging it in there and packing it in there and melting. So much better with just one and uh, a little bit more often, but who cares if I'm home, right? So the Hasty Baker 1864 looks downright sweet right now. And I'll start that up this afternoon after it dries out a little bit. And then in two days, I'll give it a second coat. Everyone have a great day. And remember, take care of your cook stove.